But anyway, uh, you'll notice there's some ports on here, and uh, I will try to show you how that works. I think I know how it works. Basically, it's kind of cool. Your pilot's going to slide onto this part here, the flat part, and then your ship, in our case, the R-Wing. I was going to just drop it, but I was going to push some things. Uh, that pops on top. You'll see the, the little tab there. That goes over, and your cockpit is translucent. I don't know if that comes across with the lighting. But basically, your man's... Here, I can, hey, I can show you like this. Your man's shows inside of it. Ooh. So, and I think there's a backlight or something so that uh, you can kind of see it through. So that I wasn't quite expecting, but that's pretty cool. Um... It feels like the the R wing. Oh, the yeah. Okay, cool. The R wing things do open and close too. If you want to display them as such, I don't know if they. I haven't seen any like stands for these. And then you'll notice there's uh, slots on the wings as well. That's where your uh, extra weapons mount. I uh, the switch one came with freezy missiles. Why is my cat being loud? I fed you. You're watered. It's stream time. You know how this works. Sorry. Um. And a flamethrower. And those just kind of pop on like schwa. And you can, uh, with the main ships, you can pop the wings off. Yeah, cool. I didn't, I didn't know if the R-wing was going to be interchangeable, but that's pretty sweet. Uh, and you can like swap them between the ships. There's, I think, eight ships total. Um, the R-wing, obviously, Switch exclusive. Um, and then GameStop has an exclusive one nose on this is curved and i'm making sure it's supposed to be uh and who does who, who are the other exclusive i can't remember oh target so the gamestop people like me so they held a uh one of the um exclusives they got for their uh batch for me i'll probably pick it up the end of the week starting next week i got kind of have to pay some other things and i'm spending more money than i ought to this weekend but whatever um but I should have that paid off by Monday. So that'll be squared away. And then uh, I need to swing out to Target and pick up the one that they're offering. And they're, they're also selling separate pilots because each pilot has their own pilot ability. I think there's ground uh, stuff as well. Uh, this one came with two pilots. The regular base set for the other systems comes with just one and one ship. It's this guy with a metal butt and uh, his ship. But the, uh, otherwise, I basically, you can get any pilot even without getting their ship. But it's cool to get all the ships. And then, again, you can swap the wings, and it'll it'll reflect the visual changes and whatnot in-game. I believe. This is what I understand from the advertising. But let's, you know, play the game and check it out. How about that? That seems like a thing we could do. And should do. Because that's why I started this stream today. Okay. Let's do it. Hey. Oh, look. It's ready to go. You can also link your uh, Ubisoft Club account for some extra mods and stuff, but you need to earn them. Some U points or whatever. U bucks, U points, whatever. U bucks? I don't know. Uh, to unlock those. You do get some freebies though. Like, I got like a bonus armor thing or something for free. The Welcome to Starlink pack. So, um, yeah. I haven't really played anything. if I could rotate the ship. Um, how to use Welcome Starlink. To the Starlink initiative. I'm guessing Sage, this... And I'm, 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 I'm glad they used the R-Wing for Starlink this since it is the Switch version. It's cute. To begin, slide your Joy-Con controllers into the Starlink mount. Press until they click and lock in. Okay, I'm going to turn that down a little bit so you can hear me over it. Okay. Oh, your controllers are in. Got it. Make sure your Joy-Con controllers are paired. Okay. At least so. Next, Should be. link a pilot. All right. Slide your pilot into the front of the mount and press firmly to connect it. Oh, it's even got slots on the side to make sure you uh plug it right too. Ah, finger slipped. I was like threw him off of there. He, he has weak angles, so be careful. Do not like wiggle these ships to, or the characters too hard.
So you do need to be a little gentle with the figures. They are like really nicely detailed. Like if I can get that up in there, like it looks good. All right, so yeah, he's in. You can swap your pilot at any time without losing progress. Yeah. So that's cool. Each pilot has a unique and powerful ability. Okay. Next, link a starship for your pilot to fly. We can do that. I will Lower put the other tiny man over, over here. The mount and pilot, so the pilot enters the cockpit. Once your starship is linked, press down firmly to secure it. Okay. So let's be gentle, and I'll let you see what I'm doing here. I feel like but it's not quite on the pilot here. Okay. Flip the sides in. Okay. It might take a little bit of wiggling, but it's easy to be careful about that. Okay. Oh, cool. And the back lights up so you can make sure your business is good. I'm, I'm guessing that that's the same for every ship. You can mix and match wings like, to change be the thrusters. of your starship. Yeah, I don't have extra wings. Them securely. Yeah. I see. They're capitalizing the word link because... Uh, yes, Pokedame. You, you kind of have to get the starter edition because otherwise... Well, I think you can play without a ship. But I don't know why you would. I, I, I would imagine you would need at least one ship. And yeah, Mega Man, I, I was looking at the other ship packs and I'm like, I didn't want to become a collector, but I think that's going to happen. I was saying at the top, I'm probably going to go pick up the uh, Target exclusive... And GameStop is holding uh, one of their exclusives for me. When I, so when I have money, I can pick those two up, and then the other ones I can just throw on my Christmas wish list or whatever, because they're going to be pretty much everywhere. Link weapons to prepare for the possibility of battle. I could do that. I think you always have a basic ZL weapon too. To fire your left weapon and ZR to fire your right weapon. Okay. I'm not going to do that now. We're going to hang on to those. You can hot swap them mid-battle, too. There's actually an option. You can set it so, uh, you, you like, normally it'll pause if you're swapping weapons. Uh, you can set it to not pause. So you can just be like, boop, 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 boop. Which is kind of cool. Switch weapons to adapt to any situation. And from what I understand, I believe each ship comes with two weapons, and then there's two weapon packs. Oh, okay. I didn't know there was an eShop version. Okay, well, thank you, Pokedame. So apparently there's an eShop version, since I don't have chat up, I'm going to explain that. Uh, but you get five ships and some of the characters, but you don't get anything to play around with. Which is kind of half the fun, honestly. Like, again, all, all these figures, they look really good. Clean this man's metal butt. I'm going to show that again. Um, he, he comes as a second pilot, because I think he's like the main character or whatever. Uh, that one comes in every edition, but again, R-Wing only switch. You can fire hyperlasers from the wings of the R-Wing if no weapons are linked to them. That's what I want. When you want to remove your starship, twist it and pull it up. Okay. Remember, so it it kind of seats like um, Ram does in a computer. Time. Use Starlink to adapt to and overcome any challenge. Now you're ready to begin. Good luck. Okay. Well, we learned something today. Well, dang, if I knew there was a digital deluxe, I don't know. Uh, whatever. Um, still, it's, it's nice to have this freaking sweet R-Wing, so. Okay, and uh, now it's actually recognizing the ship I have connected. Otherwise, it just kind of assembles one. Yeah, I'll, I'll probably just get them all. That's what we do here. I hope they, like, make stands or whatever. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, go shoot a thing, I guess. I was just looking at this other... Uh... Yeah, we just did that. All right, cool. Options should be set. I changed the uh, temperature to Fahrenheit just because I'm a filthy American, which is I'm loath to admit it, and um, that makes more sense to me. So any, any Celsius lovers out there, I apologize. I haven't learned that one. I tried. I know what? Zero is... Zero is freezing. I know that much. 32 boiling? Or no, 32 is... No, 100 boiling is Celsius, right? Or 100 Celsius is boiling? Anyway, whatever. Let's play the freaking game. Uh, normal sounds good.
Yeah, that's cool. I haven't seen a pack with... I think there's one ship I didn't see a pack for, and it might be a starter kit one only. I hope not. Because, like, I hope they release, release that one for people who got the digital or the Switch version. Oh. It updates like the Joy-Cons do. That's fair. There is also, when you first get this, uh, if you haven't picked it up yet, there is, uh, if you get the physical edition, there's a, like a crunchy download. Uh, it took me like 30 minutes, and I have, dec I have a pretty decent connection, so just a heads up. Oh, okay, you can get you can get pretty much everything as DLC. That's pretty nice. Yeah, I, I, I like, it's kind of set up Toys to Life is kind of dead, and this is just coming, to, coming out now after that all kind of croaked, but... See, again, it's only, what? It's only eight ships, plus, uh, I think, I counted, yeah, eight ships, 16 weapons, and, um, I guess eight pilots? I didn't check that one, but, like, that can all fit on one shelf, on your standard bookshelf, so, that's easy to display. Oh, he's so fluff. I oh, I love the glowy collar. I kind of want with that version of the coat, honestly. <laughs> oh, they put the good luck in! That's my favorite part of the tank game. All right, um, so yeah. This is a performance ship. Okay, all right, we can spin now. Spin to win. Uh, it's got the jimmies down, so I'm gonna put the jimmies down. Style points. Ah, that one's not all the way down. There we go. Oh, I see. The top and bottom move independently. I thought they were kind of geared into each other. Um. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, like, I'm kind of surprised the Xbox and the PS4 mounts aren't uh, cross-platform. Like, again, with the Switch one, you've got to put the Joy-Cons in there. If I can rotate that properly. There you go. So, that makes sense to me. But. You would think the other two would be fine. And yeah, the, the ships are surpri like surprisingly large. Let's put it next to my fat head for comparison. And like even the ship packs, again, ship pi yeah, the ship packs with ship pilot two weapons, the individual ones, twenty five bucks, which is considering what some of the Skylander stuff sold at and whatnot, or um, even like some of the yeah the regular I think what the what were regular size Disney Infinity figures like ten. Amiibo or uh, Amiibo or twelve ninety nine. So compare that size and content wise. It's a pretty good deal. Oh uh, yeah, and you do you raise a good point there, Mega Man. Amiibo are kind of exempt from the Toys to Life thing. A little bit special. Um, now I got a thing from the club, and actually, unfolding the R wing things all, all the way uh, kind of conflicts with the button placement. So we're gonna dial that back a hair. Um, I, okay, I don't have any mods. I guess the free bonus I got from the club just kind of came with it. Or maybe I have to open the club screen to unlock it, but whatever. We'll, we'll live. Unlike the uh, on-screen ship, the, the wedge bits on the sides, they do not light up, which is unfortunate, but I think we'll live. All right, so yeah, I think we're we're, we're just gonna go in raw at first, you know, just plain vanilla R wing, and all right, and we're gonna pew pew. Okay, and now they so there's some those are the two weapons that come with it, and I guess this one's just a default option if you need a. Uh, Kinetic weapon. That's that's cool. Cool. I like it. All right, let's uh get underway. I guess. Uh, I don't want to view loadout. I want to. Oh, let's learn about pilot skills. Why not? Okay, everything is locked still. That's fine. We'll uh check that out once we get ready to rock.
Okay, after being in contact with an alien that crashed to Earth, astrophysicist Victor St. Grant has secretly recruited a team of pilots to explore the stars. And the alien judge and the team Starlink guys, people, I didn't read the whole thing, I'm sorry. Aboard the Nova powered mothership, uh, the team arrives in the Atlas star system. I just read the. I, I, I uh, initialized the Atlas star system. Don't do that. <laughs> We're not going to abbreviate that, thank you. That is a. I like I like I like our drive frisbee. That looks cool as hell. We're here. Oh, that's Metal Butt guy. Okay. Jewel of the Pleiades. <gasps> Look. <laughs> Welcome to Atlas. Oh man, I'm gonna get so many hits back on Earth. No, you're not. Levi. No yeah. one's supposed to know about this. Oh, Hoodie Kid is the one that comes with the uh, Chase, Levi. Target you exclusive ship. To help Hunter with the escort. Okay. Wait. Said one of us. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder what's up with the big uh, bubble suit, dude. I like to. He's got like this curvy ship called the Neptune, which I thought was pretty cool. Probably gonna be the first one I buy it's outside incredible. of the Limiteds. I can't believe you've been doing this for a whole year. Our third trip hasn't gotten old yet. And she's the one in the uh, GameStop exclusive card her ship. The artifact it's on a card. Might just be the you know what I mean. We need. We're closer than ever now. I know it. Proximity warning. Oh, he's a floaty ghost man. That's even cooler. Looks like our delivery is coming in hot. Who ordered a golf? On. Universal translator. Can you hear me? What happened? Do you have it? Yeah, but these guys don't like it when you steal from them. Sensitive types. Could use a little help here. She's not gonna make it. Get to the Equinox. We're coming. I'll man the bridge. Judge, take Mason with you to the hangar. We need to buy time for me to jumpstart. Oh, the Judge is the alien sure. they found. Okay, okay. Bubble boy, got it. They've never used Starlink before. Go show them what it can do. Take my ship. You're ready. All right, mentor old dude is totally going to die within the first three chapters. Yeah, that's the one I didn't see a pack for, the one with the, the little hemispheres down the, the fork in the middle. Maybe get in your ship before the airlock opens. That seems like a better idea. Warning. Coolant cycle terminated. You think that's bad? Yeah, the generic main guy, uh, hero protagonist. Oh, there we go. There's my boys. Uh, hero protagonist ship is the one that comes in the pack in for the other two. You boys seeing this? Yeah, but it's not Wolf, so who cares? It looks like they're outnumbered. You know what I'm thinking. Absolutely, positively not. We came here for one reason and one reason only, and that is to take down. Peppy, you're not my real dad. Yeah, his Oh god, the music. I'm sorry. I, I should have retired back on Corn area. Uh slight case of feels. Don't mind me. Okay, uh L to move. Oh. L stick up. I don't know if I like that. Okay. And I have auto level on. All right, this is making it a little more. Okay, I can get used to this. Where did these guys come from? We could use a few extra ships. And I actually kind of like the twin stick option. It's just uh, 
also looks like we're all headed to the same place. We may not have much of a choice. That voice actor sounds okay, familiar. Looks like we've got a few more wingmates. Hang on, Shade. We're on our way. Okay. Oh, ZR. I'm sorry. Another down. It's just get. It's weird having the uh, directionals on the uh, left stick. There we go. Destroyed. Got him. Okay. Boop, boop. Oh, uh, can we not do that? Starlink database updated. Nope. Little too close. I might unreverse the controls. I think I'm used to playing Star Fox Dirty Style. It's also been a while. Not fast enough. Check this out. At least it's not motion controls. Are you kidding me? I did one, and I don't remember how. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Knock, knock. So it's gonna be a little difficult for me to re uh, watch chat while I'm doing this, but oh hey, friends. Ugh. Target's destroyed. Woohoo! That. Nice that was that was uncalled for. It is, yeah, it is kind of like Halo vehicles, just with, uh, and you can, I think you can customize to some extent. I should probably look a little more into that, because I figured the, the left there? stick was going to be up and down. Tell them to hang on a few minutes longer. And honestly, I would kind of, I, I told you he's totally dead. Breach in reactor hull. He's dead. Everyone, back to the, ship. The, been the hull's been breached, just not the reactor. And that's how they show you how the hot swap works. Take him with us. Oh, great. Oh, I guess they were called the Legion. Makes sense. No. Bye. They just took our toys. How heavy is that gotta be? Yeah, I was trying to zero R twice, and it wasn't kicking in. I figure that would just be your basic pilot ability, although he's apparently he's got the ability to call in the entire Star Fox team. No, 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 no. Uh, this is a bad call. I guess this is Atlas. All units, report in. Boys, I'm here. I survived. Do you read me? I repeat, the Equinox has crashed. All pilots picked up. I'm a little upside down right now. Nothing's getting through. All this I'm not really liking that bottom texture, but everything else looks good. Um. Oh, recover your ship. Whee! Uh, flight engines are down. Yes, I'm on reserve power. All those little wiggly bits. Voice. Probably gain a little height. Hello, friends. Do, 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 do. Oh, actually, I'm gonna just want to see real quick if we can adjust that control. No, it's, okay. Not remappable. That's unfortunate. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And yeah, to be fair, you would not be looking at the bottom of the ship. That is correct. <laughs> Cut corners where you can. 
We'll get used to it. You want a dead. Enemy analysis complete. Recommend short range weaponry. I like short range weaponry. Well, let's get a flamethrower on here. That sounds fun. Er. I didn't link it in. There we go. Alright, and now we got a pew pew. I like the little weapon charge thing. Like you got two shots ready to go. A way out. I, I bet there's like some like hidden Looks boss like enemies and stuff. If you wander off. Uh, hey. What now? Enemy analysis complete. Recommend elemental combination. A little bit of frost barrage. I got that. Ah, you can... I see. It's very RPG-like with the, the numbers flying off and stuff. Which I didn't quite recall from the, uh... You asked for it. <laughs> you made it. You're the last one from the, uh, um, E3 demo. Beppy, everyone okay? Fox, is it? Well, we were ambushed. Whoever attacked us kidnapped our captain during the battle. We appreciate your help, though. Well, they're not gonna get away with that. Come on, let's go get them. So apparently, my controls are non inverted on the Grant ground. Also stole our reactor. There's a backup, but until we get more fuel, we're not going anywhere. Hmm, gotta be something we can do here. Maybe there is. I rigged our tech with their ship. Okay, check out your map. Cool. Uh, but, yeah, there's your ship. You should be able to oh, see I like I kind of like the smeary map is. reveal. That's cool. The rest of the planet's uncharted territory for now. Grayson, yeah, I had it. Uh, I'm picking up an alien signal nearby. I had it inverted for space. Apparently, I should you invert it for everything. There? Worth checking out. Feel free to give the map a spin. Because you can't really Not go up or down now. that I can see. Once we explore more of this, oh, place, there's oh, there. there's of course it's it's an Ubisoft game. Of course there's uh oh the five spires. That's how you unlock more map. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm dollars to donuts.